Hey everybody, Tyler Grimm here with Nip Strip Irrigation. We are here in Clay Center, Kansas today, central Kansas, separating some hog manure and uh, pushing it out through the pivots. We're pulling out of the deep pit hog barn here. The pit was completely full yesterday when we started. So we have a submersible pump dropped in there, pumping it to our trailer, which is going to our screw press here. Our screw press takes out the large particles. We have a screen in here that is a 0.2 millimeter screen. And basically inside of here, there's two screws that screw the solids up. And there's two screens on either side that are pinched against them. And so that's how it gets the solids out. The liquids drop out of the screen and drop into here. Here's what the solids look like coming off the hog manure. A lot of pig hair, a lot of corn holes, and what you would think you would see from feed. So that's what that looks like there. After our screw press, it goes into this first chemical tote here. Gravity flows into there. From there, we're pumping it out of this tote. We have a submersible dropped in this tote, and it pumps through this green hose right here. From this green hose, we are going to this tank. And then from this tank, we have a seven and a half horse booster pump on the back that's pulling it in and pushing it out to that eight inch flange right there. That eight inch flange is going to a pivot line and they're pushing manure through their pivots here. So most of the time, we're pulling straight off our screw press tank, which is that chemical tote there that I showed earlier. We put that green hose right onto that cam lock fitting there. But today we're not using the micro filter because a pivot doesn't need to go that fine. When we go to drip, this is what we use. We, we go to the micro filter, which filters it down even further and gets the really small, fine particles out. That's how that concept works. And basically, <clears throat> the clean stuff drops. It's got a rotator inside there that flings it around and the clean stuff comes out the screen. Dirty stuff goes up the top and out that top discharge and that goes to the pit. The clean stuff just flows out of there into that tank and we usually pump out of that tank. Here's what the screen looks like that's inside of that microfilter. So it just spins in there. It's just a big basket, basically. That's the scoop. Thanks for following along.